So another thing that Jamie wants to do is set up a moderation workflow. What she wants is for authors to be able to write content but not publish it. She wants to be able to review first and then she can decide to publish or not. Drupal 8.3's content moderation enables her to do exactly that. This site already has workflow enabled for the purposes of this demo and workflow has also been enabled for this particular content type. So first, let's look at what one of the Louvre's authors, Henry, sees when he goes to edit this piece of content. With the default workflow enabled, he's going to see a create new draft option, a save and publish option, and a save and archive option. Now let's see what it looks like to actually configure one of these workflows. Here you can see the states. The first thing Jamie wants to do is add a new state. She will call it ready to review and she's going to make it the default revision, but not published. In addition to a state, she's also going to need to create a new transition. She's going to call that transition mark ready to review. Now, let's go back and look to see what the author will see when he goes to submit content. Now, when our author, Henry, goes to edit this piece of content, he will see that he has the option to just save or to save and mark as ready to review. He does not see the save and publish or archive options because he's looking at a draft and the only transitions from draft are save draft and mark ready to review. 